Here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, some locations with a little thin slushy coating of snow early this morning, especially in northern suburbs. Everybody transitioning over to rain showers, and they're long gone. Take a look outside, and even though it's cloudy in Easton's Beach, there have been some partial breaks in the cloud cover. And as mentioned earlier, the trend will be for some gradual clearing this evening and overnight. We're not expecting any more uh, rain showers for this uh, late afternoon and early evening. Temperatures now, high temps today, topping out only mid and upper 40s, uh, 47 in Providence, 45 Smithfield, just cold enough around 4, 5, 6 o'clock this morning for some of our northern suburbs to get a little bit of wet snow but the ground is now bare again as we look at temperatures now really not much change we're still holding in the middle 40s so dry a little chilly for tonight with uh, temperatures heading down into the mid 30s more rain on the way not for tomorrow but actually thursday likely some of that rain will be widespread and just a little bit on friday i think Friday end up, ends up being mostly dry, but a passing shower. Weekend still looks cooler. We'll show you that in the seven-day forecast. There goes the precipitation from today. You see drier air behind that. And when we take a look at the clear skies through the Midwest and the Great Lakes, so all of this clear weather back in here belongs to us for later on this evening, overnight and through most of Wednesday. So here's the big picture. We'll start off right now. Rain is well offshore. Skies are clearing out. Here we are tomorrow morning with clear skies. Really a nice day, sunshine, right on through tomorrow evening. This system right across the Midwest, this is tomorrow night at uh, 7 o'clock. This is what's headed our way for Thursday. That's the next chance for some rain. Here's a more detailed look starting off this evening. Watch the time bar and you can see the skies clearing out, temperatures cooling down. So by, let's stop things at 8 o'clock in the morning. Sunshine starting off in the mid-30s, a little bit of a chill, but overall it's a real nice day, especially on tap, especially when you compare it to what's on tap for Thursday. 2 o'clock in the afternoon, we're reaching the low 50s, nice and comfortable. Some clouds increasing later in the evening and into the overnight hours in advance of that next system which arrives on Thursday. So for tomorrow morning, we are waking up to sunshine. A little bit of a chill at 6 a.m. by 11 o'clock in the morning, mid to upper 40s, and we'll reach the lower 50s tomorrow afternoon. So a nice day. 3 o'clock, we're at 53. 6 o'clock in the evening, sunshine and dry. 49. Of course, the sunset now getting closer to 7 o'clock. All right, seven day forecast. Here comes the rain for Thursday. Now it's a cooler day at 45, and not out of the question especially early in the morning. Could be a little wet snow mixing in across northern suburbs. The calendar version of spring officially arrives at 11.49. It's the earliest first day of spring in 124 years. But the first full day of spring is Friday, and it will feel like spring. Look at this temperature that we're forecasting, mid to upper 60s, a very windy day. Now, the 60s will be realized inland. I think the coastline on Friday will be cooler. Just a couple of showers. I don't think it's a washout. I think most of the time, Friday is actually dry. Your weekend looks good, but it is much cooler, especially Sunday. Sunshine on Saturday, 47, much cooler, but dry on Sunday with sunny skies and temperatures in the lower 40s. That's your latest forecast. Mike Caroline.